Today marks the end of an era. For the hundredth time, I'm going to be rearranging my room. Before you click out, today I'm going to be significantly simplifying my room, which is something I don't think any of us ever thought I would say. If you know, you know that I have always been someone who heavily decorated. Every inch of the walls had to be covered in something. I think living in kind of more of like a cluttered environment majority of my life, it affected the way I like went into making my room. I'm sure you guys have heard your environment is detrimental to the way your life goes, your success, building better habits. And it's something that I finally, I think, come to the conclusion of. If you have been struggling with organization your entire life, you look at your room and you feel a little bit overwhelmed, you have a hard time managing your spaces, this may be the answer. I'm kind of shifting towards the minimalistic lifestyle and I think it's going to solve a lot of the problems that I still have yet to fix. I not only struggle with organization in my environment, but also within my like self, keeping my thoughts organized. Always just jumbled up in the head. I think this is where I need to start. Oh. Probably would have been smarter to take everything off first. <gasps> Bruh. Well, I just watched a video right now on how to properly take off the command chip so that doesn't happen And I just tried it right now and it works, right? I don't know why I did that Like it was kind of my impulsive thoughts thinking like let me just do it and see what happens Even though I kind of knew what was gonna happen already. You literally drag this down. Keep on going Ow, much better I am seeing the vision come to life. So far, I kind of have the layout down, but today is where we're going to start decluttering, organizing, a little bit of decorating, figuring out like how I want to place things. The outfit today is giving major drummer boy vibes.
deciding what decor pieces I want to keep and which ones I kind of want to store away. My old self would have found a way to place each piece of decor somewhere. We're definitely not going to be doing that this time around. The idea is to be like clean, simple, open. I am going to be storing away my prints. That is crazy only because you guys know prints were like my thing. My one collage wall that I had in my room before like took up an entire wall. We are making changes. We are making progress. I feel like I'm finally beginning to understand the saying less is more. I'm gonna be getting rid of some plants. Just know of what feng shui is, which I don't even really know what that is. What is feng shui? Feng shui is an ancient Chinese art of arranging buildings, objects, and space in an environment to achieve harmony and balance. I've heard that plants really don't fit the vibe of feng shui. Personally, for me, plants always kind of make the room more alive and like colorful, but I think I did go a little overboard this past time around. I've honestly been pretty decent at keeping them alive. But I will say I have struggled and I think in order to not only keep my room simple but like my life I think I have to get rid of some plants I don't know how I found myself building another piece of Ikea furniture, but yet here we are. I bought this dresser with the purpose of having more space for my clothes, and surprisingly this time around it was a tolerable experience, and we were able to get the thing done in less than 24 hours. <laughs> products to see if I want to keep them. I did not really anticipate decluttering as much as I am right now. It's just overwhelming, but I think it's going to be for sure worth it and satisfying and cleansing. Makeup is one thing that I think I have a little too much of. Here's a basket that I'm currently decluttering. <laughs> In this pile, I have all the stuff that I'm gonna be keeping or at least giving like another month or so, throwing this stuff out. And then this is the stuff I'm going to be giving to my friends or donating.
I feel both relieved and stressed out at the same time. I think the stress from like getting rid of stuff that I really didn't want to get rid of, but also feeling relieved that the space is already cluttered. At the end of the day, I think it's very necessary to declutter, especially at the beginning of the year because you probably accumulated so many things that you didn't know was even there. Don't forget about your candles. I am finally parting ways with this candle. I think I've had this, I want to say since when I lived back at my old apartment. It no longer really serves me purpose even though it smells really good parting ways with things that you don't want to get rid of is difficult but trust me you'll feel so much better after <laughs> I think this change is really different. I look around and feel like something is missing and I'm finding the urge to put up some prints and fill up the space. Over here, I don't know if I showed you guys this, but I ended up adding this little bench, which originally was where our dresser was. It's in this little nook over here, but unfortunately because this dresser just doesn't fit where the current bench is, we have to put this here instead. Bench is from Target. It actually originally goes in our dining area, but I brought it in here to kind of see the vision come to life because I had an idea of having a little seating area in my room somewhere. I finished putting this little card together and just put camera stuff and then a few journals in here. So far, I've kept everything pretty organized down here. Moving on to my desk. This is like my favorite space ever in my room. Over here, I just have this clear jar that I, I just put my highlighters in here. I feel like it could be easier to reach for like when I'm studying. Here, I have this blue Yeti microphone. I recently picked it up. This, I haven't brought this keyboard out in a while used to use it a lot in my last apartment. Over there in that little corner is my diffuser. And then this little corner over here, which is probably my favorite addition to the room. I just think this is like such a cute little space because of these corner shelves. Like they make it so much more cozier, especially with the little Pac-Man. And then I have my Hermione over here in the corner. You guys will be seeing this a lot more in study videos, so stay tuned. Oh, and there's you. I don't know why you aren't angry today. Let's put you back to beep beep. Happy. Bedding is all from Amazon. I recently switched over to like this gingham duvet cover. Probably will end up switching my bedding at some point again, but I love this color. And looking at it, you honestly would not think it's from Amazon. It just looks really high quality. I came in and I put up one print. He is the last one standing. I really debated putting up two prints either on top of the bed or to the side of it, but for now, I just think it looks good, like empty. This used to be the corner shelf that was there previously. She is now horizontal. Looks so much better like this in my opinion. I ended up using this little box from Ikea. I used to put my record player on here, but I just ended up putting books and this little plant here. I think the plant here looks lovely. I will say my little addition to the shelf is my boyfriend's <laughs> cubby. He likes to come over and leave everything in my room and throw all of his shoes, his socks everywhere. So it's just his own little cubby and I tell him make sure to put your stuff in your cubby before you make a mess in my room. I also have a little book stack with my mushroom pot and then I also have this little guy. He talks to you guys. I don't know if you guys have seen this on TikTok. I have this tag on here. Hi guys. I can do Happy birthday to you. Hi guys. Hi guys. Hi guys. No. Okay. Anyways. <laughs> I don't know why this outfit right now is not giving what I thought it was giving. We did bring in this circle mirror and she is now in a new space, in a new home. I did end up putting a few new things on this shelf to kind of rearrange some things over. And I think I like it so far. I honestly didn't really like what was on my shelves before. And then we have my dresser, which I'm honestly so satisfied with this. This has already been so much of a relief for me. I just have this Prada book and I had this one in the living room. I kind of just stole everything from the living room, honestly. <laughs> and here I did end up organizing my clothes in here tank tops and like regular shirts This is my workout stuff, which I just organized, but you know, you know me. Okay. Okay. That is the end of today's video. I start school in the next Two days, which is terrifying. I'm not terrified. I'm excited, but like I definitely will be filming all that So make sure to be on the lookout for next week's video. Bye guys mm -hmm.